I want to make change. So I'm involved because I think it's the right thing for the profession. And I also, maybe this is a little paternalistic, but I also want to make sure that it's done right. And I just feel so privileged to be with so many other talented board members that bring different aspects to this mission. So there's so many advantages to telemedicine. And so I don't think it's that big of a jump uh, psychologically, but I do think implementing it is the challenge. So how do you reorganize your workflow? How do you monetize it? What are some of the best practices to adopt? So operationally, I think is the challenge. I think everyone's ready to do it mentally, but putting the pieces together will be a little difficult. Veterinarians are very innovative and flexible and evolve over time. You know, we evolved from basically horse veterinarians when the world was filled with horse and buggies and not automobiles and evolved to companion animal and evolved to One Health initiatives. So I really believe that there's a lot of opportunity and I think we know how to grab the opportunity, but we're also cautious because we wanna make sure that things are done properly, which is why there's such a debate in telemedicine in this profession to this day, right? Those of the camp that insist there should be a physical exam as part of the VCPR and others that say that telemedicine can strengthen the VCPR by allowing that the VCPR be established through telemedicine if in the judgment of the veterinarian that is appropriate. Just like we make judgments on everything else that we do, I think that we should allow veterinarians to make proper judgments because medicine is not plug and play, right? Medicine is very much of an art and based on your judgment and intuition. I think the VVCA is really a one-stop shopping holistic approach to telemedicine. So if you're looking for certain resources, they should be there and you're not looking at resources in a vacuum either. You're looking at the resources or where plan is to provide resources so that they coalesce together so that we can provide the entire bandwidth and scope for anyone that is involved in this space. I don't know that there's any other place that has that. So various organizations, of course, have um, done a lot of work in this area. Uh, AVMA, of course, AHA, uh, VIC, certainly have done uh, various components of this and the VVCA is taking a lot of those resources and then adding more resources as well but visualizing it from a beginning to an end.